Protesters aired their plights on the annual opening day of Hong Kong government's house, but the expected anti-parallel trading protest did not happen. Some complained that government security was selective in deciding who was allowed to premises. Sai Su has the story. The annual open day at government's house. Inside, the crowd has come to enjoy a touch of spring to the sound of live music. But outside, tensions ran high. Heavy police were deployed to the event as 50 officers lined both sides of the rear entrance. Hundreds more spread out in and round the garden. Rallies were banned outside. Refugee Union Hong Kong, along with Socialist Action, calling for a stop of the SAR's discriminating refugee policy. Please confine them in a small area and ban them from lingering on the Lower Albert Road. Hong Kong Indigenous spokespersons Ray Wong was booted out after he put on the uniform of his organization. He said he's very disappointed. People Power's chairperson Eric Yun made herself to the house, but the police escorted her after a commotion. She later joined other members, including Tam Tak Chi, calling for Chief Executive Wen Chan Ying to step down. Lo Yok Lin, widely known as female long hair, tried to send a message of genuine universal suffrage in her own way. One hour before the end of the opening day of the government house, as you can see, there are still a great number of visitors are waiting for the security check. Anyone who brings slogans are not allowed to get in. The Thai screening check are meant to ensure the protesters don't get past the gates. That upsets some people. They criticize the police of their rudeness and accuse them of abusing power. Some, though, managed to sneak in. Police carried away this protester and kept her yellow umbrella as testimony. <laughs> Former anti parallel trading demonstrator Chan Ho Han said the police mistook him as protester in the garden when he was simply standing beside them, taking photos. I don't know what they want, why, why take me outside. Uh, I just stand here and take photo. And they take me out and fight me, fight my face, fight my hair, and then uh, fight my body. Both, all bodies have fight, and then uh, uh, you can see here, and then you will see here. A man was kicked out from the garden after he was suspected of obstructing the police. <laughs> Government security turned away 21 people and arrested two others. The government number shows 14,900 people visited the government town this year. Netizens of several groups on Hong Kong Golden and Facebook has earlier threatened to stage an anti-manager protest at its historic mansion. They plan to bring luggages and take out daily essentials to mock parallel traders. But they did not show up in the face of strong civil aid services presence and police in plain clothes. 300 officers are on hand to make sure this will be a day of enjoyment and voices of dissent are kept far away and unheard at Hong Kong leaders' home. Sai Wu, BNN News, Hong Kong.